today we are all going to become 3D map designers and engineers. The things that you need are one piece of paper. It can be scratch paper so long as there's one blank side. Four different colored markers, preferably not permanent markers, and a spray bottle. The first step in making your 3D map is to crumple up your piece of paper. And then uncrumple it, but don't flatten it out all the way. The next step is to take one of your markers and draw on your 3D map the mountain tops, the very highest points of your map. And I am just going to trace along the highest points. Like so. You're next going to take the second color and draw in the lowest points on your map. These represent the valleys. The next step is to take your third color and draw where water might flow or pool. So think about where gravity might pull water down the mountaintops, or water might flow or pool down in the valley. Think about waterfalls or rivers. So now on our map, we have clearly defined the mountaintops, the valleys, and the water, whether that be rivers or lakes or streams. And we have one major thing missing from this map. What do you think that is? It's us, because we're a part of the watershed too. So with your last and final color, you are going to draw yourself. You can draw yourself inside of your house, maybe where your school is. Where do you want to live? So I think I want to live next to some water, not very high up in the mountain. I'm going to draw my house right here. And I want my school to be close by. So I'll draw my school right here. And you can draw your house and your school and the park next to your house, however you want to draw it. I'm going to draw where my cousin lives. My cousin lives over here, kind of up in the hills. It's a long drive over there. So now I've completed my watershed map. Now it's time to use our spray bottles. What do you think this water represents? Let's take a moment to think about it. If you guess snow or rain, you're right. We're gonna make it rain on our 3D maps. Now let's take some time to make a prediction about what will happen when you spray your 3D map. Let's find out. Grab your spray bottle and start spraying your 3D map. You don't need to get your map so totally drenched, but just enough that you can start seeing what the water does to the markers what the rain does to this landscape. A 
watershed is an area of land that drains rainwater into a nearby body of water, like a creek, lake, bay, or ocean. When I look at my map, I can see that the rainwater drained down the mountains and formed maybe a river over here. And over near my cousin's house, maybe it formed a lake. So take a minute to observe your own map and see where the water flowed and answer the following questions.